Hey guys, so before we went to this whole virtual learning thing, we were learning about Martin Luther King and what he did for civil rights. Because as you guys know, people weren't treated the same. And so it's probably been about a month since we've talked about it, but you guys were showing that you really were understanding it and we never got a chance to read this book. It's called What If Zebras Lost Their Stripes? So while we're reading this book, I want you to think about this. What does this have to do with Martin Luther King and what was happening during that time? And think about what could it mean for you today? Okay. What if zebras lost their stripes? What if the zebras... What if the zebras lost their stripes and some lost black... and some lost white. Would they think that it's all right? Or would the zebras start to fight? What are you guys noticing about the two types of zebras? Would there be separate zebra types? if the zebras lost their stripes? Hmm. Looks like all these animals in the middle are saying, what's going on? There's not, they're not even talking to each other. Would different colors be the end of living life as loving friends? The picture's really showing a bad storm and everybody's angry. Would zebras see themselves as zebras? Or would their colors make them start? Hmm. I wonder if this makes you guys think of another book. They're drinking from some water, different water fountains. Would zebras see themselves as zebras? Or would their colors make them start to only see the black or white and not what lives within their hearts? Two different sides of a canyon. Would there be separate zebra lands? Could black and white friends still hold hands? Because hmm. they're still zebras, right? Zebra children be okay to join together, laugh, and play. That makes me think of the book The Other Side that we read, where they were on that fence. I know why God gave zebra stripes, so that there'd be no black or white. So they went from black and white to both. But zebras would be much too smart to let their colors tear them apart. And that's the end. So I want you to think about what's the lesson in this book, okay? What's this book really trying to teach us about how we treat other people, how we treat each other, how we treat our family members? Does it matter what we look like or does it matter more about what's in our heart? Hope you guys enjoyed the book today. See you guys.